earlier in the week, the Attorney General canvassed for support for the conduct of Public Officers Bill in Parliament at the second reading stage. The bill, if passed into law, will guide the conduct of public officers in the performance of their functions. The Constitutional, Legal and Parliamentary Affairs Committee is currently considering the clauses of the bill, which is expected to provide clear guidelines for contentious issues such as conflict of interest and the asset declaration regime. Chairman of the committee tells City News what the main issues in the bill are. Conduct of Public Officers Bill is a bill that has been in waiting for a very long time. Conduct of public officers, that language is not new. It is in the Constitution already. And we also have in existence a declaration of asset acts. We have all kinds of rules and regulations about code of conduct of public officers and then um, conflict of interest. So the the Public Officers Bill 2020 is seeking to give more potency and more flesh to the Constitution and to the already existing en enactment. The chairman of the committee further provided clarity on the asset declaration part of the bill. If you fail to declare, it's an offense. I mean, it's an offense. And the Auditor General has a responsibility in this new bill, so far as I can recollect, that periodically the Auditor General must publish public officers who have declared their assets and those who haven't declared their, their, 